Welcome back in this morning's What's Going Around. Perhaps you're feeling it right now, that sniffling, itchy eyes, sneezing, all those sure signs that allergy season is here. Cindy Greisel, a physician assistant with Mercy, says she's seeing a lot of patients right now who are struggling with upper respiratory symptoms, and they're often unsure if it's a bacterial infection, if it's a viral infection, or is it allergies? Here are the symptoms of seasonal allergies to look for. Itchy, watery eyes, your clear, runny nose, um, maybe a little bit of sore throat from just kind of that post-nasal drainage, but not that knife streppy type sore throat, but just that drainage going down the back of your throat. Um, maybe a cough if you've got some drainage going down. But she says some symptoms that are not associated with allergies, a fever and body aches. To relieve those allergy symptoms, she recommends starting with over-the-counter antihistamines like Claritin, Zyrtec and Allegra, nasal sprays like Flonase or Nasacort. And if you know you suffer from allergies, she says you don't want to get behind the eight ball with your symptoms. So a lot of times I have my patients, if they, I know they're sensitive to certain allergens, I'll have them start their allergy medicine even before they're symptomatic to try to hold things at bay. If those treatments don't work, she says, then it's time to see your physician. Your allergies could have turned into a sinus infection or you may need to discuss prescription medications or other remedies for your allergies. She also suggests if you know what allergens affect you, try and avoid them as much as possible. For example, if you're allergic to grass, wear a mask while you mow your lawn. And to find out what the counts are for our area, you can head to the Springfield Green County Health website and they do the pollen count. Now, right now, this is under maintenance, so check back to make sure sure that you are getting the correct ones but just for yesterday they're showing mold right now low trees high so that may be what's causing some of that uncomfortable symptoms that you might be dealing with right now and you can catch my full conversation with Cindy today on the digital desk at 10:45. we go even deeper into some different remedies for seasonal allergies